Hello again guys, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to get the wobbly windows effect on Ubuntu 14.04 um, LTS. Um, as you can see that I'm running Ubuntu 14.04 LTS, just for, so you know. Right, um, the first step that you do is install this here, Compiz Config Settings Manager, and you can get that from either the Ubuntu Software Center or through a terminal, which um, I will have the commands in the description of this video on how to um, install Compiz through a terminal. So yeah, um, once you've got it, you just open this. Um, you might need to download extras as well, but I'll let you know how to do that as well in the description. So it says CCSM, which is Compiz Config Settings Manager, is an advanced tool. Use of caution. This tool has deeply configured Compiz settings somewhere like that there. So yeah. Um, once you've got this open, you just go down to this effects, and then you'll see wobbly windows right there. First, make sure animations is ticked up there, which it normally will be anyway. And then just hit wobbly windows, and your computer might freeze for a minute, and then it'll like refresh. But once that is done, you will have wobbly windows. Um, and it's not just with compass, obviously it works with anything that you open. So as you can see, um, and for people that don't know what wobbly windows is, I will just quickly show you what it's like without Wobbly Windows or what it's like when you first install Ubuntu or any Linux distro. Um, so this is what you'd normally get, just this boring movement. And with Wobbly Windows, as you saw before, it's much better, it looks, it's smoother, looks better. Um, I just prefer it and a lot of people have turned it off and they don't really know how to get it back on 14.04 but now you do and yeah thanks for watching this video I'll be making more videos soon on how to get um, different stuff on Ubuntu also there's an XBMC video coming out soon which you get all the latest movies from the cinema etc but that is copyright so I can't do that at the minute but um, yeah I made a Skype video, how to get Skype for Ubuntu, which you guys may have already saw. If not, make sure to check that out. Thank you for watching this video again. Um, don't forget to subscribe. And peace.